and welcome back to Let's Play Escape. And I believe this will be the final part, ending with spikes and many deaths, because we're going to demo all the game overs. The quickest way to do this, I believe, is to just jump off a cliff continuously. So, let's do that, shall we? Can't skip past this. Well, we've started, I can. What the hell, I still heard a monkey sneezing, this game is so weird. So the oh, I couldn't enjoy the monkey after sound or whatever. What am I talking about? Right, goodbye Spike. Yes, just scream and spear. We're gonna have a monkey now, because it's cooler. Right. Whee! Got a lot of lives to lose. Kinda starting to regret collecting so many, but I did kinda need quite a few of them. I guess. Whee! Sneezing monkey, what the fuck? Goodbye, Spike. Whee! I believe I can fly! I can't. You know what, I'd be quick with a dash heap, so... Or super heat, whatever. Whee! Oh no! Man, this has been such a great day. Nothing can go wrong. Oh shit! No! Man, I did such a good job saving the day. I'm such a great. No! Oh shit, it's Spectre. No, Spectre! 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 No! He killed me like I deserve because I'm a bitch. Two girls, one cup. No. They're making a movie of Bleach. What? No. People still reading the root. Oh, what? No. I looked at how to read thirteen again, and Obi's bias made me go. No. Um, insert creative point about Super Toad here, I guess. In which I imitate a living. Whee! Sneezing monkey's freaking me out. I can't take it anymore. What's over this way? The last play is over? No. Well, ending anyway. Spike, keep trying. Yay, Charo, whatever your name is. Woo! Keep trying to kill myself more. That's Spike owned number one. Now I believe my lives go to something ridiculous like four or something, yeah. Which is actually five because of the zero life. I remember Crash Bandicoot 2, you have five lives, including the zero life, and in the instruction manual it said, This is the biggest problem, I can't fucking start it without having to press. Why is it doing this? I swear to fuck. Can't you wait until I'm done with the Let's Play? Well, I guess then you wouldn't be doing it all, but whatever. Still annoying, and I don't know why it's doing it. But yeah, well, my point. In the structure manual it says when you get a game over you start with five new lives, so I thought, wait, is this like some kind of glitch or problem with the game? Because in this case I should have more lives. Because it's like four, even though there's a zero life. It is weird, but whatever. So I guess it actually counts the extra lives, even though it calls them lives. Yeah. But yes, no problem. It was actually meaning the four lives and the zero life. Now that was a lot quicker, wasn't it? Come on, try again. What? Charu? What? You again? Maybe it just loops through... Maybe it like does the same character and then it does different ones, I'm not sure. Or maybe Charu just secretly loves Spike. I mean... 
what with the professor and Katie always forcing themselves on her. It's pretty interesting, I mean, she does seem quite concerned about Spike as well. And it's weird how she has emotions, seemingly, even though she's a computer program, so... Hmm. Never knew that. Come on, try again. I guess they're not watching the part where I'm deliberately killing myself. I mean, both times I was just like, is it going to be spectacular? I was like, so excited and it wasn't. But still, Char is cool, so I'm not complaining. I mean, they're all cool, to be honest, so it's no real problems. I think, well, there's not a lot of characters, so it's just her, Spectre, Buzz, Katie, and Professor have, um, Little speeches when you die, who next? Wait, Spike. We're transferring you to the time station. Yeah, I remember this. Well, he gets awfully close, doesn't he? Jeez, back off. Hey, transferring your breathing bad body to the time station, we'll just leave it there. Like barely breathing. He's like, oh, I need some medical attention. No you don't, you're my secret experiment. Oops, I'll let it slip. Yes, you're genetically altered to take this kind of stuff. I know it's. I've seen the tests. This is the armor test. Oh yeah, I can press start. Get that. So this is what you get, Spike. I mean, what the fuck? How dare you actually get Spectre? I mean, just imagine like a monkey's put like a mind control device or something in him, and they're making him dash all for like body control. His mind is just in despair. This is what he gets, that's why he has the despairing scream. This is what you get, Spike. This is what happens, man. Yeah, that's what happens. Woo! I mean, this, if I do say so myself, seems like a pretty unique part of Let's Play, don't you think? I mean, like, I don't like to blow my own trumpet, but, you know, I think I wouldn't see this too often. It's continuously killing myself. It's for a good cause, though. Wait, did she say let's transfer to a safe place, or did you say let's transfer him to a safe place? I think she said let's transfer to a safe place. In which case, she's transferring with him. So, she's with him alone while he's just lying there unconscious. Sharu, come on. You should get these people's consent. Just don't force yourself on him. I mean, now that is boys like pretty much anyone come onto them, so, you know, you don't have to get all these sneaky routines, Charo, just, just confess your love already. I've done so many parts of this play, I wasn't planning to do it, I mean, I mean there's a session I've done so many parts, but you know, since I'm ending it anyway, and these are all bonus parts, I figured, might as well. Because usually I only do a f like an hour's worth, like three part, three twenty-minute parts. I'm doing more now. I mean, it is the end, so might as well. Yeah, this should be the final part. But depends on how many game overs there are. I mean, that's free for Charo. I assume they all have free. So once I've seen free for each, I've already seen that. Oh, I bet I'm going to have a lot of repeats and. I'm surprised at how many charos there are. I mean, there's just, I guess it makes sense for there to be the same chance for there to be any game over. But so far, that's four charos and one professor, so. Jeez. <laughs> Holy odds! Like the most minor character, and she's getting the most. It's amazing. So I'm, I'm not. I don't think I've ever actually seen all of these. I mean, I think I did look for a few of them once until I got bored. I'm not sure if I actually looked at all of them. I'm not sure if I took the time to try and do that, so it should be a learning experience. Do your best to kill you, yes? Spokes just like, how could you do this to me, man? We worked through this Let's Play together. Well, so did that fucking monkey and that triceratops. 
You deserve this, dude. You deserve this. Who'd have thought that Spock dies at the end, huh? Spoilers, Spock's about to die. Yep, he's dead. Can't think of anything, sorry. Oh, I've already seen that, god. Gosh darn it, even. Oh, there's gonna be a lot of repeats. I'm not sure if I'll cut a lot of this out because I don't think it's been boring by my standards yet. I mean, I can see people enjoying this, even the parts where I'm continuously doing it over and over again. I mean, for one thing, I don't expect my one subscriber mind hearing my voice more, so. I'll just keep on doing it. If you haven't found this boring, then well, fuck it. You can just move across the t uh, progress bar. You don't have to fucking watch every second of it. Yes, yeah, exerting actual effort to damn it, damn you tree. Stop trying to save him. Woo! He's dead. Indeed, he's dead. You're getting <laughs> and your lips aren't even moving, what the hell? He's like, oh, he just got severely injured, oh well. Yeah, I know it's getting sloppy, I bumped into the tree, I should have killed myself quicker. Alright, so that's all three for Chari, because I think there's three of them. I mean, it seems like a good round number, you know. But uh, uh, this is amazing, because like, I never thought about this before. But it seems like Ape Escape is the best freaking game over sequence ever, because there's so many of them. I mean, sure there are those games where, depending on the situation, you can have a different game over sequence. But um, you'd only be able to find that one for that situation. But in here, you can find loads of them in any situation. So. Like, let me just figure this out in my head. That means that there's 15 of them. Yeah. There's 15 different game over sequences. 15 different ones that can occur in God. That is quite some dedication. Some dedication to put so many game over sequences, but. There are also some lazy parts in this, so just the game design in general, you know, how can, you can see through stuff, but they put effort into this, so it's funny. Okay, good, that's a new one. So that's two out of three for the professor. Right, three of Charu, one of... Katie and two of the professor. Indeed, it has. I'm just wondering. Uh, can you see spectres and buzzers in this? Because um, when you first start this level, of course, they haven't been revealed yet. So. I mean, revealed in their current forms, so... No, not the current forms, but the forms for the majority of the game, so... I'm not sure if a revisit, they'd bother programming it so you could see them, or if they just are an all-game over sitting I'm not sure about the ins and outs of it, but... I'm just hoping, because... I'm just hoping to see just a buzz or a spectre at some point, pretty soon, just to put my mind at rest. Because I'm starting to worry about that, like I'm... Here I am committing suicide in this place, but I guess it's better because that cuts up six of them, so I have less chance of repeats. And again, no, I still have chance of them over there. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, no, let's to a safe place. Come on, Charo, I know you love him and all, but I want to see the different game overs. You just go to your. You just take it private with him, and I'll be testing this out. Hmm. 
and I can just continuously kill him. And then you can leave me alone. Yeah, you didn't even have to see any of the showings of the level because I skipped past it so quickly. It's probably a quick way, but yeah, probably a part. Mm. But then again, is there any at the start of the level? I don't think so. This is still pretty close to the beginning of the level, so you know. I don't think any start you off at like a platform where you can just step off or anything, and that's the only way it could be much quicker, you know. And they all start well our class starting to cliffs, but so is this. Come on! I've had enough of you, I wanna see some others. What why does they with charos? She's like the creeper. In my Minecraft let's play, there's like this one mob that just keeps on showing up. And she's like, yep, I'm gonna shut up again this time. You know it as well as I do. She's just trolling me at this point. Damn you, Charu. You're the villain here, not Spectre. Now, I know. She's mad that I killed her off in that weird little description story thing I was doing. I'm not sure if I'm going to continue that in my other parts. By the time this is on YouTube, you'll probably know if you've looked at the descriptions anyway, so... I mean, if you're wondering why the he how the hell that idea came about, um... I was watching an audio commentary of this video by some guy and he was saying that on a lot of videos he was just putting unrelated descriptions of like different plots and notices of different series Wait, I'm just going to call it here. Okay, I've already seen that one. But, um... Yeah, he, he, he was putting descriptions of his videos with just like plots of different movies and stuff. Like, he had Rambo and another one I'm not sure of, but... I so, thought, well that's a pretty funny idea, but what if the description is not only do they have nothing to do with it, but they're actually a completely original story? And what if they're like, well, not completely original, because they're also based on the series, so like, okay, this time the story, this happens, but like, what the fuck? So, I don't know, it's a bit more of an original and related rather than that, so, I like it better than what you did. And I like the idea of, wait, what? Oh, for goodness sake, it's doing what it did in the Ice Age now. Like that one time when the controls are completely fucking up. Okay, it stopped now. I think it's when it unplugs it does that for some reason. It just runs left and it's just fucked up. <sighs> well, it was partially unplugged. Ooh, yeah, I'm yawning. How terrible is that? I mean... Anyway, I'm up 20 hours. Which is quite a bit actually, so whatever. But not that long. Jeez. Oh, for goodness sake! <laughs> I could see this taking a while. Oh, that part's actually ended. I should cut out a lot of this, but I'm not gonna because you want to hear my talk. I know you do, you're my important one subscriber. I mean, I'm just assuming here because I can imagine this being extremely boring. Right, one more for the past ended, I think. This is just silly though. I'm mean, silly. Wait, I just realised something. I could just use save states here, what am I doing? Because I'm pretty sure it'll still be a different one every time, because it's random. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna test that. Now I'll do it when he's falling so it's the quickest way. Dude, why did I think of that? 
but it's 20 minutes now so I'll just bring them down to zero lives just for the extra cliffhanger. Right, next time let's play Apescape. Will using save states bring me the same game over every time or will it be randomised? I don't see why it wouldn't be randomised but we might find a way to quickly see all of the game overs. So this wasn't the final part because it took so fucking long for me to figure that out. Right, next time most likely is the final part of Let's Play Escape, so yay, it's the grand finale of Spike dying again. I'm sorry for not being very fast. See you next time. Whee! Camera, what the hell am I doing? I don't even know anymore. I lost my mind on this long ago.